everybody. In this presentation, we're going to be looking at the Parallel Rig Evaluation Tool inside of Maya 2016. This is one of my favorite new features in Maya because almost every artist is going to benefit from it. With Parallel Rig Evaluation, we can efficiently evaluate your scene and use all the resources the computer has, both CPU and GPU. So we're going to be using the profiling tool to assist us in this presentation and find all the speed that a file may offer. So right now what we're looking at is Maya in the legacy mode, the DG evaluation mode. And if we move this character's arm around, you can see that it's a pretty sophisticated rig. It's got squash and stretch, it's got FK, it's got IK. And if we look at the outliner, you know, there's a ton of data that goes into this rig. It's a very robust rig the technical director set up. The problem is, when using the old legacy mode of evaluating the scene, it's not that fast. So if we kind of zoom out here and we play this guy back, what we're getting is around four, maybe five frames per second. And that's because Maya can't use all the power that this HP workstation has. Let's go ahead and look at the performance profiler and get a good snapshot of how Maya is utilizing those resources. So we'll bring up the profiling tool, which is really cool because not only can this profile the native Maya tools, but you can also add in any plugins you write, any null scripts or any Python scripts you can mark up so that they also get profiled. So with the profiler up, what we're going to do is we're going to just play back our animation and we'll record that data into it and we'll see how Maya's tapping into the power of this computer. So what I'm looking at right now is, again, using the legacy mode inside of Maya, and this data is not that dense, it's not packed that tightly, it's not that tall. If we look at the threaded view of this, you can see that Maya is really not using all the threads. There's a little bit happening here, but almost all of the work's happening on one thread. And this isn't good. All that power is just basically sitting stagnant. So let's go ahead and jump into our options and turn on the parallel mode. Now I'm going to turn on just the parallel mode and have it only hit the CPU. So we'll go into parallel mode here. We'll rewind this guy back and we'll close this guy down and we'll play it back one more time. So we went from four frames per second up to around 10 or 11 frames per second. So that's a pretty significant speed improvement. We jump back to our category view and go ahead and rerun the, the profiler tool. You can see that the data is packed a lot nicer. Lots of stuff happening at the same time here, but we still have these very large bars. And that's showing me where Maya is spending its time. And if we click on one of these guys, you can see that that's basically my character suit. It goes ahead and it selects it for me when you click on it inside of the profiler. So these are the things that are taking the most time. The deformations, the skinning, and all that stuff can actually get dumped onto the Quadro K6000 card. We can compute those on the GPU. So let's go ahead and turn that component on and see what happens to our frame rate. So we get that GPU component going. You can see that it's enabled. The GPU override is grabbing a lot of that data. Go ahead and play this animation back one more time. Kind of zoom out here, frame it up nicely. So we went from four frames a second to over 40. That is a significant speed improvement. Let's go ahead and run that profiler one more time and see how that data stacks up. So you can see this is exactly what you want. All that stuff happening concurrently, all that stuff executing at the same time. We jump over to the threaded view again all those resources of that HP workstation being tapped into to give us that massive speed improvement. So that's really what parallel rig evaluation inside of Maya 2016 is all about. Taking your workstation and efficiently using all of those resources. Thanks a lot for checking it out. I hope you guys find this as beneficial as I have. It really is. This is a game changer. It really is awesome. Cheers, everybody.